Metz, northeastern France. Destination Jaumont. After a long journey, we finally arrive at the Jaumont mine. Objective? To see how Matek's new plants work. Matek is a worldwide leader in the design, production and installation of wastewater purification and filtration plants, with over 1,000 plants sold globally. Matek machines work simply guaranteeing 95% of working hours in heavy-duty plants such as mines. 7-7-24-24 Matek water treatment plants are designed to maximize returns of the aggregate sector in sand and gravel washing processes. Our plants are perfect to recover and recycle sands, whose value is increasing, and to reuse water in the production cycle. Waste water is collected in a small pit made of concrete, ready to be clarified. Through vertical and submersible pumps, water is pumped to the silo decanter made of stainless steel AC304. Halfway up the pipe, the flocculent polyelectrolyte is injected. It is a biodegradable, non-toxic chemical product, which reacts with suspended solids, speeding their settling. The Doson system takes samples every two to three minutes that will be analyzed by photocells to regulate the products according to solid quantity and settling speed. Water reaches the silo through the counter cone on top and it is clarified. Slurry, thanks to the polyelectrolyte action, becomes heavier, separates from water and settles at the bottom while clarified water goes up and overflows into the drainage gutter to end in the clarified water tank. Water treated by Matek decanters is purified and ready to be reused. Once it reaches the necessary compactness, the settled slurry is discharged by automatic valves and it falls in the homogenizer tank. Thanks to Vibron system, valves open only when it has the desired density, 40 to 50% by volume. That is possible thanks to specific components like oleodynamics control units and pistons, oversized frames and high pressure pumps, and especially thanks to Matek Engineer's specialized design. The cycle begins with the control unit that closes the plates and keeps the chambers closed. At this point, working pressure reaches 350 bars to resist the counter pressure created by the mud feeding pump. Once every plate is closed, the feeding pump starts filling the chambers. The HPT double or triple case pump sucks the mud from the homogenizer tank and pumps it inside the filter press. Thanks to pressure, solid particles are kept by the filter cloths, while water flows through them and it is recovered by the drainage pipes. Having filtered the mud and recovered the water, the filter press ends its cycle when the probe does not detect water anymore. Consequently, the mud pump is stopped. Once complete dehydration has been reached, up to 20% for aggregates and below 10% for minerals, the filter pack is opened and the mud, now dry cakes with a very low residual moisture, falls down ready to be disposed of. The opening of the filter press is done at once or in sections to optimize time. TT2 Fast is the fastest opening system on the market and guarantees a reduction of cake's discharging time from 15 to 20 minutes to 3 minutes. To assure and guarantee the discharging of all the cakes, Matek filter presses installed the Gasser patented system to shake the plates automatically. Matek High Technology, with more than 20 types of controls and alarms, helps to avoid any kind of breakdown and plant stoppage. Through Siemens, Allen Bradley or Schneider PLC and touch screens, it is possible to monitor the filtration times and the cubic meters produced in one hour or in one day. The three C's, capacity, competence, courtesy, are the key to Matek's success.